hi guys welcome back to another video so in today's video we're going to be carrying on with our news app uh, series and um, if you want to see the playlist as well i will link it in the video as well so we've already got a tab bar we now can collect our news what i actually wanted to do is to actually look at a challenge that i set back in the first video of this um, series so i basically wanted to look at how we can use the text object and leverage that to easily display dates in swift ui so let's look at how we can add this date label in to our articles and if you uh, watched the original video um, of where we built this app there was actually a property that comes with article called date so i just go into the model now we actually already do have a date object that comes back and gets decoded for us so let's use this now now this is optional so because this is an optional what we're going to do is we're going to safely unwrap it using optional chaining so let's do that now and with the text object as well we essentially get a new parameter called style and what style allows us to do is it basically lets us to do define the type of formatting that we want to use for our date so let's use this now so you can now see that we basically got the time um, displayed for us automatically and we didn't need to write any code or logic so normally if you're if you're new to this then you, you're probably not aware of this but normally in ui kit you'd normally have to use like a date format a class or you know format the date um some other way yourself um but with swift ui this new style um, parameter for text allows us to easily just give it a case and then it'll do it for us so swift ui man is always looking out for us so let's look at the other options that it gives us so if we just click into time that's by um holding command on your if you hold command on your keyboard and then click into it so you can see here that we actually have a list of all the possible outputs that we can basically get for our um style now the two we're going to be looking at is time and date so essentially what i want to do is i want to show the time and the date um next to the um labels so let's add a, another um text object cool and now i want to actually i want these actually to sit right next to each other i don't want them to be you know vertically aligned so what i'm going to do is i'm going to pop this in a h stack And now you can see that they're right next to each other and then just to finally just to finish this off um i'm actually going to reduce the um spacing and give them some sort of like format just to make it look nicer as well so let's do that now okay cool so as you can see we've now got them aligned next to each other and we've now changed the style of it but looking at it from a ux like standpoint um it's pretty difficult to see uh, just at a first glance what the time and date is so what i'm actually going to do is i'm actually going to bold the date so it stands out more and then you can instantly see like yo you know this was um, posted on the 20th of february so let's do this now cool and now you can see that it didn't take us too long to do that either we've now formatted the dates within our app and it's displaying it nicely as well so you can um, you know see it so what i'm going to do is i'm going to run this and we're now actually going to see it in our app so let's do this now cool so now you can see that we actually have our date formatted and we have the time as well as to when it was posted as well so, okay cool so that's it for today's video it was a pretty quick video um we didn't really do anything too crazy because swift ui makes our life so much easier now i'd re definitely recommend that you go back in the playlist series um and watch the other videos to get your app to this state um as always as well um, if you enjoyed the video give it a thumbs up i'd appreciate the support also as well um, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and um, hit the notification bell for any updates as well don't forget to you know comment in the description as well if you have any video ideas that you want me to do and you know if you have any feedback as well i'll see you peeps in a bit deuces